Singer and former signee of Lynx Entertainment, uh, Ms. V, has revealed that depression forced her to have the music, to leave the music scene for some two years. The Come and See My Mother singer revealed she resolved to take a break to do soul searching as her condition got serious. <laughs> There were rumors that you had problems with some of the other signees mm -hmm. at Lynx Entertainment, and that's why you parted ways oh, with them. Never. Is that true? These boys, they're so sweet. They're my younger brothers. Did you feel threatened by them? Never. Come on. Never. Because, honestly speaking, I was glad they came on board because it kind of felt, you know, lonely. You were lonely at Lynx? No, I wasn't. But, you know, I started with a girl group, and all of a sudden it was just me. Mm -hmm. So the switch was like, okay. But, I wake uh, up, and but now, when they came on board, we used to go to shows together. It was fun. It was fun times for me. Well, what I heard was totally different because I heard that the moment they came on, you sort mm -hmm. of felt threatened, especially because more attention was being given to them. Yeah. And so it made you feel as if they weren't doing as much for oh, you no. anymore. No, I think it's just rumor. But I didn't leave links. I left music. I sort you of, left music? Yes, I gave up on music two years ago. What? It's, it's very emotional, you know, because I was super, super, super depressed. Like, my mom would call me and she's crying on the phone with me. Or she comes to see me and she's crying with me just because. I don't know how to handle myself. Well, Being a musician, mm -hmm. people don't know this, but it's, it's really a lonely life at a point. You know, you have all these people you hang with and you have all these people who say, I love you, you know, but... At the end of the day, you don't know who truly you loves know. you. Yeah, it's just, it's just really strange. So it's you, a strange thing. You felt people were faking around you? Oh, definitely people who fake around you. But I had some honest people as well, and mm -hmm. they are in my life today. Okay. And they're some of the people who helped me through my tough times. But I didn't leave links. You I left love, music? I love links. Yes, but I left music. And it was, it was tough. How did you uh, battle depression? Family. Okay. My mom, she won't stop and praying for me and she's always talking to me. My sisters, my brother, my daddy, shout outs, they're watching by the way. Okay. <laughs> yes. So it was family, it was some friends, and my road manager now, Jesse. Okay. Michael, my mm -hmm. administrative my it, it was just a few people I've known for a minute. Yeah, so these people basically helped me through it all. Wait, are you back mm. to music? <laughs> um, yes. I'm Is going it, to. Um, I'm not sure. If no, no, no. Really I am. Coming. I'm actually going to release in three days. Oh, you are night. finally. Yes, and the song is titled Sheriff. Before the song, how did you develop the interest again? Because you said you left music. You know, you can't cheat nature. You can't. You just can't. Mm. This is something that has been. I was born with music. Mm. I can't say I will not. It's the only thing I know how to do very well. So mm. why will I? give away a gift that God has bestowed upon me, I will be very ungrateful to do that. Did you get